title of my brief presentation this morning is simply make them say wow. Wow is such a wonderful little word. It's tight, it's compact, it, it has a function as a verb and as a noun. It's just a great little word. To wow someone is to totally blast past their expectation. Wow is also an exclamation. When I, when I saw Parks and I saw Zane, I was just, wow. I mean, it's, it's great. And, and that's what you want to give your customers is the wow experience. My life has been a charmed life because in my work, I've had the wonderful opportunity of sitting down and talking to one-on-one -on -one a lot of wow people. And I've tried to deconstruct what it is about wow people that makes them that way. Some great opportunities. I've had the opportunity to sit down with presidents. I think one of the most unique opportunities I ever had was I spent an afternoon with Michael Jordan's mother. And I asked her, how did you do it? And she looked at me and she said, well, Michael Jordan's just one of my children. I've got four others that are just as great. Wow. So I started thinking about what makes a wild person, and as I have talked to people and read and studied and presented and engaged organizations all over, I've kind of come to this conclusion that mediocrity sucks. <laughs> the, the last thing that our world, our planet needs is people who are waking up, looking into the mirror and saying, today I'm just feeling like sucking. I, I, <laughs> Our nation, our world has been made better by people who determined to make them say wow. I mean, people who had an incredible vision. And wow people are like this. Wow people move the world, they shape the world, and they leave it better than they found it. Wow people are different because of the way they think, because thought informs action. So what does it take to be a wild person and what is your calling? I believe that individuals, dealers, and organizations are all driven by the same thing. They're driven by attitude, they're driven by persistence, and they're driven by action. And wild people think differently. Here's what wild people do. And I'll use the word wow as an acrostic, W-O-W. Wow people think like winners, and this is going to seem really simple and trite, but it's true. Winners, first and foremost, think they're going to win. They have faith. Wow people have this wonderful opportunity to take the obstacles in their lives and turn them into opportunities. They understand that challenge is what makes you great. And then wow people finally will do the work.